హాయ్ గైస్ వాట్సాప్ వెల్కమ్ బ్యాక్ టు మై ఛానల్ దిస్ ఈస్ సాయిచ్చరం మల్యాల ఎ గ్రాడ్యుయేట్ ఫ్రమ్ ఎన్ఐటి వరంగల్ సో అకార్డింగ్ టు జోసా ట్వంటీ ట్వంటీ త్రీ స్కెడ్యూల్ టుడేస్ డేట్ ఈస్ జూన్ థర్టీ సో ద రౌండ్ వన్ సీట్ అలాట్మెంట్ రిజల్ట్ విల్ బి అవుట్ టుడే సో లైక్ అకార్డింగ్ టు ద స్కెడ్యూల్ ఇట్ షుడ్ బి ఎట్ లైక్ ద సీట్ అలాట్మెంట్ రిలీజ్ డేట్ టెన్ ఏఎం సో బై ద టైమ్ ఐ పోస్ట్ దిస్ వీడియో బై ద టైమ్ ఐ మేక్ మేక్ ద దిస్ వీడియో లైవ్ ద సీట్ అలాట్మెంట్ విల్ బి అవుట్ సో వన్స్ ద సీట్ ఈస్ అలాటెడ్ ఫస్ట్ థింగ్ ఈస్ యూ హ్యావ్ టు చెక్ ద రిజల్ట్ సో వేర్ యూ హ్యావ్ టు చెక్ and how how you have to check what you have to do is what i am going to discuss in this particular video so without taking much time let's get into the video first thing is let's see the schedule if you see the schedule in the round 1 column june 30 friday that is uh, today 10 am seat allot allocation round 1 so you will get the seat allotment result round 1 seat allotment result based on the choices you filled after getting seat allotment from today that is june 30 till july 4th you have the time july 4th 5 pm you have the time to do online reporting previously during my 2019 that is the final batch which had the offline reporting wherever uh, like we should visit the nearest iit or nearest nit so that's how it used to be now it has become online reporting so where you have to complete fee payment seat acceptance fee payment 40000 for gen- open category general ews obc ncl 20000 for sc st pwd then document upload let me just give you clarity class 10 mark sheet class 12 mark sheet state of eligibility again class 12 then uh, medical certificate then one more thing uh, category certificate if you are a category student and uh, pwd certificate if you are a pwd student you have to complete document upload and you have to respond by candidate to query all that we'll discuss in this particular video so let's go now you will ask me where we can check the result so here in this portal as i am shooting this video one day before because today uh, like i am traveling to gurgaon because my job location is in gurgaon and regarding company and placement package and all i have already discussed in fi- finally placed video please watch that video so he, under this candidate activity board here ra- registration and choice filling is there right for josa 2023 there they will give you round one seat allocation result for round one like that i will show you last year recorded video so that you will understand how it is going to be there okay i'll show you last year's video so that's how it is going to be there you can see view seat allotment result round one if you click that so once after clicking that so you will be taken to this particular page where you where uh, you will be asked for je men's application number and je men's password so this is don't confuse again this is last year 2022 recorded video so this uh, like it is not possible for me to record as i am in traveling so that's why i'm uh, posting this particular video just to give you an idea so the process is going to be same except from the otp so this year the security due to security reasons they have added one more layer of security that is give, sending the otp to the registered mobile which is a good thing so keep your registered mobile with you so enter your application number enter your password enter the secu- security pin and click on login so once after you doing that so once after entering the details you like you can just see on the left side seat allotment result so we have to go there seat allotment result once you go there you can see these all these things will be in red incomplete so this particular student already completed a uh, few things two things that's why it turned into green color completed button first you have to select the seat allotment result so if you click that seat allotment result it will show you what seat you got allotted according to your rank and according to your choice filling you can see this particular student last year got a choice round number one choice number 106 according to his rank or uh, like 36332 open category other state quota nit manipur ec this is what he got last year according to his rank and according to the choice filling now the second thing is download the initial seat allotment intimation slip scroll down there is option called print initial seat allotment intimation slip if we click that his seat and seat allotment letter will be downloaded so this is like really important then then what you have to do then then he have to go to willingness submission so under the willingness submission he have like i chitturi mahesh like i so and so your name so you have float slide freeze these three options what you want to keep either float either slide either freeze so i think you already have the clarity on what is float what is slide and what is freeze so according to that whatever you want to select you can select here in the willingness submission so once you click slide now there is no chance for you to come to float in the next round okay so if you are clicking slide now for the next four rounds next the remain the, for the next remaining rounds you will you will only have either you want to be in the slide either you can freeze it that's it you can't come to float again so if you are in float you can come to slide or you can come to freeze also in the further rounds but if you select slide now you can't come back to float at any time in any of the round that's what please keep that in the mind so once go through the uh instructions given below you'll understand everything so after that you can select you can submit your willingness then 
the next step is upload documents in the documents so as i already said class 10 certificate or birth certificate you can upload any of them second thing is class 12 mark sheet or equivalent qualifying exam mark sheet third thing is state of eligibility proof so my suggestion so again upload same class 12 mark sheet double time in second and third fourth is medical certificate regarding medical certificate i already made a video download that format go to the doctor fill the details get his signature stamp registration number and sign date on it then you can upload that particular medical certificate and then if you belong to some category they also ask you for category certificate here and if you belong to some uh, pwd category they will also uh, they will also ask you for pwd category so these are all the documents they are going to ask you here here you have to submit and preview and then if you move forward like after after uh submitting the documents you will get you will get this option open which is seat acceptance fee payments until and unless you complete this particular process seat acceptance fee payment option will not come so under the upload documents after the uploading the documents uh, seat acceptance fee payment option will open in that 40000 seat acceptance fee for open category obc ncl general aid bless 20000 for sc st pwd this is the amount they have to pay if they want to keep float or slide or freeze if they want to save that safeguard that seat on their name if they don't pay this fees seat will be cancelled and they will be out of the counseling please keep that in the mind okay so they have to pay that amount and whenever they pay the amount they'll ask them uh, to upload the bank account details if at any time if they want to withdraw or exit this from the counseling withdraw the seat or exit from the counseling they should get the refund right whatever bank account details you are giving there for that particular account they will send the refund so they'll ask bank details along with that either cancelled check or uh, like front page of passbook bank passbook you have to upload there so this is the whole process once you are done uh, you have to wait so once you are done everything so once you are done everything will be turned into completed green color so after that if there is any issue after from the very after verification if there is an issue they will mention a dialogue box here that this particular certificate is a wrong please try to change it so there is a query if a query raised you have to solve it before the deadline so before the deadline so what is the deadline so fourth is the before like before fourth you have to upload everything pay fees uh, submit willingness and do that all that and there is one more extra day that is june july 5th till july 5th 5 pm so if there is an issue raised by the verifying college or verifying center that there is a mistake in your certificate please try to change you have to rectify them by july 5th if you don't do your seat will be cancelled you will be out of the counseling and if you paid the amount they will refund you back so once you pay the fees only they will start the verification okay so please try to do it as soon as possible because if there is an issue raised in your certificates again at the end it will become a problem because you will not have a lot of time in your hand so my suggestion on the first day itself that is after getting the allotment try to complete the whole process upload documents fee payment and everything if not at least by july 1st you complete everything that's what i would say okay so that's about what you have to do after getting seat allotment uh, of round one. So the same process will continue for round two, round three, round four, round five. Well, uh, like of course, once you're done with this document verification and fee fee payment, you need not to do in further rounds. Even if your college changes, no document verification, no fee payment. Only once you have to do this. Okay. So whenever you get the seat allotment for the first time, you have to do all this. If you didn't get any allotment, need not to worry. Just wait for the next round. That's it. Uh, that's what you can do. Okay. Hello, that's it for this video guys if you find this is a time worthy video please do like share and subscribe see you in the next one until then take care bye bye jai hind so one more thing we already started the, the josa medici shorts series go check out our shorts for uh, the information in less than one minute Hello, please i need your support in that particular thing so if you still didn't subscribe to the channel please do subscribe and support me i'll always make content for you guys bye 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 bye